Yo, what's up guys? Um, welcome back. And first thing I want to apologize, apologize for two things. Uh, first one is I made two videos, uploaded them and figured it out that there was no music. So my uh, I took them down and one of the videos, uh, the PvP one, I will um, put music on I need and upload that. And the other one, the Hall of Heroes was the video. Some of you might not have seen these videos, but the other one um, I will just redo and I will be done in this video. And also I kind of apologize for the video where I commentated on XGN because I noticed I was a bit, uh, what's the right word for it, um, dull in my voice, like I haven't, I didn't get excited or anything. And it was my first commentation on uh, someone else's PvP. And I noticed that I should have been a bit more uh, active when I was talking. And that's my, my apologies for that. But I hope you still enjoy that video because it's really cool. And I'm really excited that I could do it. But uh, I should have been a bit more excited in my voice as well. Because I was a bit dull in the voice. This video is about Outwing B3. Uh, it, this is not a guide. Um, I will put a link in the description to a guide uh, from Neo Crown. Most few people know him. Uh, he made a guide on B1 and B2 that will be useful for you guys. But this is just to show you guys I can finally do uh, auto mode B3. Uh, I got like 80% success rate, maybe even more. Uh, sometimes it doesn't. Uh, sometimes at the boss a unit of mine dies and doesn't quite get. Uh, well, I mean I got a reviver in the setup so it, it shouldn't matter too much but sometimes it just doesn't finish the boss <laughs> and sometimes it does finish the boss quite easily so I do have final inspect on three units in the my like my Darien my Amon and my uh, Jameer have final inspect so I think that's sometimes if it never procs right that could be uh, that could maybe it, be it but uh, Let's talk about this uh, vampire. Is it worth to get any of the vampires? Well, yes, it's worth to get one, but um, I'll talk about the Hall of Heroes before. Like, I have not got the Hall of Heroes uh, Rakshasa. I didn't get that. I did get the Undine, but I actually uh, wasn't impressed with her at that time. So I fused the way that is kind of stupid because I see how good she is right now and I'm feeling like oh that wasn't the smartest but hey it happens and the light sucker bus i didn't get that one um which i think is stupid of myself because the light sucker bus is very strong and i should have gotten her for my light team but i didn't uh why did i not i couldn't auto b2 i think and autoing b1 was not an option for me at least because it takes forever on my cases you should have done that <laughs> but on the water vampire I should not do that I mean he's not the greatest monster and I doubt he's gonna be the greatest monster but um, it's definitely worth if you can out to b2 definitely do that definitely get one at least one I'm doing this uh, to get a few fodder uh, I want to get some units to fodder so I can make my next six star uh, and that will help me quite a bit because uh, this uh, just getting it instantly a four star saves uh, so much uh, leveling from monster from that monster so that's really good and basically because I can do uh, B3 out of mode I can uh, get some pieces quite easily I think I get three to four pieces each time you finish it so basically if I do it 15 times you got one piece right because no wait that's 15 times no, maybe a bit more but uh, I can get quite some pieces uh, because I can out of B3 so if you can do that I would definitely go for it uh, as well because I want to have fodder and 4 star fodder is uh, nice to get uh, and I will save one I will save definitely one because uh, yeah I think uh, he has some kind of potential in some kind of dungeons Currently he's not great enough, but I think he's a decent water attacker at least. It's not like he's the worst. But uh, yeah, I kind of have to see uh, where that goes to. If I use it or not, but I want to have one at least. <clears throat> but uh, 
if you have any questions on how uh, how to do it or anything i would definitely uh, suggest you to watch the video of neo crown uh, it will be in the description so you can uh, just click on that and you can ask me uh, you can definitely ask me but uh, if there's any kind of questions you need to uh, know i think neo crown answers uh, quite a lot of them in his video already so uh, first watch that then come back to me or just ask him because he uh, he did make the guide the reason why I didn't want to make the guide is uh, first of all he uh, made it before I uh, even had the chance to made it, uh, make it and I do not really uh, have the time to make the guide if I I mean I got a lot of reviews still to be done and uh, I want to work on a few reviews uh, this evening so uh, yeah that's basically why I don't want to do that and I kind of want to do this Hall of Heroes farming uh, as well so if I would do like and a guide and the reviews and some of the PvP videos I, I was thinking like well Negron made it I'll just show you guys my outer B3 and then let him do the B1 and 2 where he shows you how to beat it and goes over the units so uh, yeah there were videos out there I was like okay they're, they're really good so let those people do that um, I'm kind of wondering how fast I can do it because I haven't timed it well I have timed it in the other one that was something like 7 minutes and 30 to 35 seconds I think we're now at uh, 6 minutes and 45 seconds but I did have a little intro on talking so Let's say uh, 6 minutes and 30 seconds. So I got 1 minute to finish it off. That's kind of <laughs> a bit too... F I don't think I can do that in 1 minute. But let's see. I think I'll end uh, the video will be done in 2 minutes. I think that's going to be it. So I can basically farm these units in 8 minutes or 8... Yeah, 8 minutes. I think that's the correct number. Sometimes if I get unlucky, uh, they, yeah, they kind of kill your units. Uh, what what is really important? Uh, that's what I will give you. Uh, what's really important to do is try to get the defense break and a, a attack break, and the attack break is more important even. Um, so you can get some sustain. Darian is one of the units that's definitely good to use because Darian uh, gives uh, mitigation, uh, which is very useful. Also, um, getting some like getting a cases in is a very good unit. The wind unit, wind jetty would be very good at supporting this. And Aman obviously is a good unit. Um, and I definitely uh, suggest trying to get the attack break. And if you could get a glancing hit as well, because that is really good. Also, stuns are very useful here because on the last uh, things. But the most important thing is just the attack break. If you get the attack break, you have a big chance of actually being able to uh, sustain your units. And if you do not have the attack break, you kind of lose your units quite fast because they do quite a lot of damage. <coughs> as you could see, my Vagabond died. He just got healed up right away and he has a defense buff now as well. So that's really strong from having a Iona MI set up here. Um, I really like uh, the unit. I need to upgrade our skills, but I also need to upgrade Jumeir's skills. And again, revival because I have to reset, and a reset is uh, a revival is already uh, off cooldown again. So that's really strong. Jumeir plus Iona is just insane. But this uh, defense break is amazing. Uh, the Darian has it, so uh, I definitely suggest you try to take a Darian with you if you have one. Okay, there we go. We finished this off. Uh, we did it in 9 minutes and 30 seconds, basically. Uh, I think in 9 minutes that will be a good goal. 9 minutes average. Wow, we just got 2. I thought 3 or 4. That sucks. But this is how I've done uh, Outering B3, and I will be doing it uh, a lot more today, so I can get some more pieces. I'm aiming to get, like, 5. 
so I can make a six star basically if I max them out and get enough four stars to feed to them. And I want to get one more to uh, keep, so I want to get six in total. I'm not sure if I can make that. I mean, I can make uh, four pretty uh, easily, but I'm not sure if I can make six. I should be able to, because I got today and tomorrow. I should be able to. But uh, yeah, that was it, man. Uh, thank you guys for watching, this time with my voice. And uh, for some of you guys um, might not even notice it, but I did upload two videos with no sound. I took them down already, so uh, don't worry. One will be uploaded with uh, music, sadly, but I will make another PvP video where I actually talk. Okay, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!